Hey everybody, I want to welcome you back for another video. It's been a beautiful day here with the, uh, um, I'm really not sure how cold it is outside because I have stayed inside all day and uh, watched TV, done some crocheting. I'm working right now on two projects. One is a granny square shrug and uh that a shrug is kind of like a sweater and then uh the other thing is a blue jean jacket and the end the bottom of it um crochet and granny squares that i'm going to attach together and then attach that to the bottom of the the blue jean jacket the only problem with the blue jean jacket project is I don't know where the blue jean jackets went. Uh, we've looked everywhere that we thought they could possibly be, and they're nowhere to be found. And so I know they'll turn up when we least expect it, but it gets annoying when you want to work on it now, and you can't until it turns up. So that's okay, though. I'll always have something that I could work on. And then for anybody who crochets, my friend shared with me um, how to make a Christmas tree out of uh, yarn doing a, I think it's called the crocodile stitch. I called it an alligator stitch earlier, but it's crocodile stitch which is a beautiful stitch. And what I wanted to do was make a green Christmas tree, of course. And then I wanted to make another one out of a, like a pewter or uh, maybe a scarlet, I don't know, just some color. And then the one that's not green use it for all other holidays and just put little decorations on it and maybe make it a little bit bigger. And I want to do it out of cotton uh, yarn. Uh, I think for a project like that, it would be a lot better than like the acrylic or, or whatever you would use. So next time at a st I'm at a store that has yarn, I'll look at it and see what I think. So with all that being said, I, I want to say this and then we'll get started. Some of y'all have sent monetary gifts and I just, uh, I really don't know why I feel like that's kind of a personal thing or whatever. And I don't, after thinking about it, I don't think maybe it is. Um, I, I, uh, I wanted to just say to those of you who have done that for us, a very big thank you. I appreciate it very, very much. And, um, I appreciate everything that everybody does. And I feel like y'all understand that. But I'm bringing to your attention about the monetary gifts because I haven't brought it up before. And I just want y'all to know, especially the ones that sent it, that I'm very, very grateful. And thank you. And I'd hug your neck if you were here. Have you ever had a grandma squeeze around your neck? It makes your gulper get like mashed into the back of your throat and your eyeballs kind of want to fall out and then they just squeeze you back and forth and that's the grandma hug and i would give each of you a grandma hug if i could okay with that being said now i'm gonna get started on some things that were sent to me and the first thing comes from a lady who has a beautiful name she makes me want to have another baby just so I can steal her name and use it on another child, but it would have to be a girl. 
and her name is Blythe. Isn't that beautiful? It's very sophisticated, elegant uh, name. I just love it. And uh, so anyway, uh, she sent uh, a monetary gift and something else I'm getting ready to show you. And thank you, Blythe, very, very much. And here is a beautiful card. I don't know if she made the card or had it made or bought it from someone or or what, but it's a handmade card and it is just beautiful. And I hope to do something special with these handmade cards or, or the ones that you could use for holiday or not holidays, but could use any time of year like this card. Maybe put it in a shadow box uh, or something so that we can enjoy them. They're so nice. But I'm going to go ahead and show you. She got some Kara Silk. And it's a conditioner, repairing conditioner. And boy, I need that. I saw today you can buy a... Um, it's just like a wand thing that you you do your hair somehow and it will automatically just trim off your uh, dry, broken, bad ends. And it showed them doing the before and after and it was amazing. I need to get me some of this and one of them and if it did that, I would probably be bald because my hair is really not in good shape. But I think this Kara Silk will be wonderful for it. And this is the conditioner. And I know there's some shampoo. I'll just have to get to it. Here is shower milk. And I am assuming it's like shower gel. Oh, that is so good, or smells so good. Really fresh and clean. And uh, I'm gonna be uh, really loving this. Uh, one thing I love at the top of my list is a good fresh shower where you've used a really nice soap or shower gel or something. And you put on your snuggly pajamas and you just smell so good and feel so clean and all that. I just love that. And then you curl up and you read or crochet or watch TV. It's nothing like it. Here is, okay, here's the shampoo. Repairing shampoo. beautiful so I can definitely use that and look at this cute little box it's got that little thing you get a hold of and then take it off inside is a beautiful candle oh it smells good the other day I was going to go ahead and light the candle and enjoy the aroma of it and then i remembered i hadn't shown it yet so i couldn't but after i finish this video i'm going to be showing it lighting it oh okay evelyn rose velvet body melt by cat crabtree and evelyn This jar feels like rubber in a way. This jar is something I think I will keep after that's used in it. It just seems like a good little trinket box or something. Very, very fresh. I have terribly dry skin, especially my legs. 
and this is going to be so smoothing and wonderful on my on my legs. Got a little bit on my hands. Mm. Okay, that is all I see. There's just paper and confetti top stuff. So, thank you with all my heart. I'm really going to enjoy all that. And the next thing, it might take me a minute to get this box switched around. I probably should have had Randy or somebody in here to help me, but I didn't really think about it. Almost got it. Okay. Now, I did my hair today without looking. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Okay. I got this beautiful really beautiful infinity scarf it said and it came from amazon and it had two uh papers usually i think there's three papers in it but it had two but it didn't have the one saying who's in it so uh whoever sent it thank you very much you have gotten got really good taste the feel of this is so nice and soft and you can just put that on and uh, twist it around a time or two and if it's really cold twist it around and wrap it around a couple times so you'll stay good and warm in here and all but isn't that pretty I love that. I wish I knew how to knit, which is what this looks like it is, is knitting. I think that is so pretty, but I had never been able to coordinate my hands good enough to, to do that. And then I have some cards. So I would like to show you those. I love that snow scene. A pretty glittery tree. A homemade card. If you've never made homemade cards, they are really a lot of fun to make. That beautiful snow scene. Isn't that pretty? Read what it says right there. A Christmas wish. I love those old Tommy. To me, those are old Tommy Christmas light bulbs for your tree. I don't really see those big ones nowadays, and I love them. Okay, I've got some more cards in here. Keeping the cards straight where I can show you every day or every couple of days. Sometimes it's a real challenge for me because... Uh, Ever since I fell uh, back, been a couple years ago now, uh, I got a concussion when I fell, and I just don't remember like I used to, and things are a little bit harder for me. So if I say or do something that seems weird, it has to do with two things. One, that concussion and how it affects you, and the second thing is... It's because I am a little bit weird. 
also. Pretty card, says peace. That one. Here's a kitty cat. And meow. Isn't that cute? Uh, praying for you. This card says nothing says gratitude. Let, like a dead bird with bread up its behind. So. I, uh, just love turkey and we don't have it but one time a year and I think that is a shame but if you don't buy turkey and stick it in your freezer for later on down the road or whatever they're so expensive very pretty that reminds me of the North Carolina mountains looks a lot like them Wonderful Christmas scene of the mailbox. Pretty flowers. Remind me of springtime. And the owl. I remember when the owl became real popular for, you know, decorating and stuff. And I think it still is pretty popular. That's a beautiful flower. Oh, what I'd give to live in that house. Just love it. The Cardinal, that's the North Carolina State Bird, is the Cardinal. Okay. I got a couple riddles for you. What's a turkey's favorite dessert? Peach gobbler. <laughs> oh, that's bad. What's the best thing to put in a pumpkin pie? Your teeth. Oh, brother. Why do you rock bands need a tur? Why do rock bands need a turkey? Because they have the drumsticks. That those sound like old people jokes. I love old people jokes. Isn't that pretty? I could be sitting on that water fishing right now and loving it. This lady sent a, a, a letter, which I wanted her to know that I got her letter. And thank you very much. And... If I kept the card in the envelope, there was a reason why. And this one is, she had sent this today's prayer, prayer card thing. And I just like to keep what they sent or what y'all send with your card, at least so I can show it. And that pretty, uh, pretty, pretty card looks like fall. And she sent me a calendar, the little pocketbook calendars, which I definitely can use. And pretty butterfly on it. Thank you for that. I really can use that. You must have been reading my mind. Now look at this. Look how pretty that is. I think this should be in a frame. So pretty.
anyway. I love that. And um Okay, the lady, the truck under the tree over there, if you've seen it by my uh, Christmas tree over there, this lady sent me the truck. And as you know, I love the trucks with the trees on them. And she sent that, and here's her card. Oh, I know, I wanted to show you what she had put on the front of her envelope. Isn't that pretty? People have the best imaginations on how to do things. But anyway, those are my cards and thank you. And this is just something I ordered from Timu and I don't know how many of you do or have heard of diamond art, but I thought this was $2 and some change, and I thought, well, for that price, I can buy one, and if I can't do it or don't like it, it's not a whole lot of money invested in it. But here is the picture it'll be three chickens when it's done and you take like these little pieces they call them diamonds but they're little pieces of rock and stuff and you go by the color coordination on here and you glue your rocks down and you, anyway not good at explaining it but you have a beautiful picture and then here's a little tray to put them in and here's the little thing you pick up your rock with to you you pick it up and then you put it on your picture i don't know if you need other things, I'm, I'm going to have to read just a little bit more before I get started. But they've got some really beautiful <coughs> diamond art pictures to do uh, or diamond painting. So if it's something you're interested in, go check them out. And I got this today and then that'll be all for today. But, um, let me get the card. Get well soon. Isn't that cute? And this is from Sebastian, you know, I'm not going to say it right. A S A B S T O N. And he says, or she, I'm sorry. I, I, I just don't know. Anyway, uh, kindness matters. Enjoy. And thank you for being kind to me. This means a lot. I have a big smile on my face where I feel, I feel the love from where you're sending this. And I had to peek and I love everything. Look at these cute hair ties. Are those not adorable? I like how they are made because they don't break your hair. So there's those. And I'm not sure where any of this was purchased. Um, milk and honey. 
Nivea. Now, Nivea is a really good brand. And that is, uh, I'm sure it's like chapstick. Yeah, lip care. Okay. Cleansing wipes. Coconut oil. These always come in handy. I have a little, two little carts I keep my, by my bed with everything a girl could need in a hurry and who's lazy and that would be me and these are going to go on my cart because uh they just come in handy y'all reese are needing a baby wipe or something or a cleansing wipe here is aromatherapy body cream that'll be good because of my dry skin. Vaseline all-purpose cream for rough elbows, dry knees, cracked heels, and dry hands. Very nice. Vaseline's a good brand. Dove. Dove is, to me, a very feminine, nice, uh, brand to use thank you for the soaps it smells so good too oh my gosh peppermint and it's the good kind they melt in your mouth and i am not going to show anybody these are going to be in my little secret hideaway and to nobody here likes peppermint but me but thank you. That really excites me. You know you're getting old when a peppermint stick excites you. And I absolutely need these. Constantly need one. And you know you never would need one until you're out somewhere. And then all of a sudden you need a Kleenex. And where is one? Well, it's not in your pocketbook because you just didn't have any and you didn't think about it. So you just go around sniffing. Well, now I don't have to sniff because why? Because I have Kleenexes. Thank you. Look at this pretty blanket, soft as can be. Uh, Comfort Bay. I love that. Love it. Thank you. Oh, a small garden flag. Isn't that cute? Ink pens. Oh, I like that. I really do, and I have never seen where they make the bold uh, ink. I like that. I like a bold ink, but if I had known that they made these, I would have already had some, but I didn't. It just helps on the old eyes when something's bright and bold. And so that is it. And thank you so much much everything you sent is very useful and and sweet of you to do and very appreciated so um i was trying to see if there's anything else but i don't think there is but what i'm gonna do now is i'm gonna get a peppermint out and sit here and watch the news and pray for the world and thank God for all of y'all. And God knows what people need. And he knew I needed y'all. Y'all make me feel like I am one special girl. And in my life and what I've been through. I really needed that. So, y'all just don't know. 
So, I'm going to go. I might even check out my pens and see what each color looks like. I'm like a kid. And I like being like a kid. So, I love y'all. Have a good evening. And I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.